Okay, so a quick update um, on the Braille device situation with uh, with David. So um, he has, at this point, uh, David has uh, started the GoFundMe campaign for the uh, Braille Sense Polaris so that he can have his own uh, Braille note taker that's a modern one uh, that he can own himself and uh, take it and, and get through college. The, uh, the State Department uh, the State Department of the Blind um, has, uh, we've put in a request for a note taker um, and um, we're not getting a lot of feedback on that at this point. Um, I, we hope that they will come through with one. Um, not sure if they will or not. Um, probably, I, I don't really know. In the meantime, they have provided him with a, a Braille display which is yet another device that hooks into the computer. Um, it uh, requires a computer to operate. And um, so there's some accessibility at least to some Braille materials. But we did find out that David has to give a speech his first day of class in the communications class, a communications 100, I believe it is. And um, so, you know, his ability to actually write and give a speech at a podium the first day of class is, um, you know, we knew this was going to happen um, to where he would be, you know, kind of forced to um, have to do some things uh, that other people don't have to do. But anyway, in the meantime, um, our, our county uh, school TVIs, these are teachers of the visually impaired, have um, understood David's plight and um, one of the directors has authorized David to borrow a braille note device um, so that until uh, he earns the money or can get that money for the uh, Polaris. Uh, so in the meantime they've decided to um, uh, give a, uh, a loaner to him to allow him to use uh, until he can find and get a node taker on his own. So this is uh, good news for today. Um, you know, in comparison on technology, it, you would be looking at the um, the device that the state gave him is kind of like a foot up, uh, you know, in te modern smartphone, telephone, cellular technology, what they gave him is kind of like a flip phone. Right, a flip phone from 10 years ago, uh, from a technology perspective. The uh, Braille note that David is, uh, and I'm picking it up today, uh, for him to borrow until um, he can get the Braille, Braille sense, is kind of like, it is, it's a smartphone, but it would be like a first or second generation Apple iPhone, maybe eight, 10 years old, eight, eight years old. So, um, you know, limited in, in most modern things, um, but, uh, still much better than um, than the uh, comparable uh, flip phone. So uh, we'll have an update soon. Um, we're going to get this Braille note, and hopefully, um, you know, David's fun GoFundMe page is doing very well. We've got over uh, over a dozen um, contributors, and um, so if you want to check that out, you can check out the link to his GoFundMe page below. Uh, and most of the contributions are coming in from anonymous YouTubers and people who don't know us. Um, there are some people that do know us and, and uh, know David, so uh, thank you very, very, very much. And a big thank you to uh, the TVIs at, at, at the county um, who um, love David and uh, want to see him succeed and not fall behind uh, in school. And also a big thank you to the... Um, to our state delegate um, who last week, um, you know, intervened on that room and board situation and got David squared away so that he didn't have to uh, worry about uh, showing up at school um, uh, to move into his uh, first semester at, uh, at college. So uh, uh, stay tuned. We'll uh, keep you updated and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. So I just picked up the uh, Braille note device that the um, county is um, is lending to David for his um, for his college time until he gets uh, a, a 
a Braille note taker on his own. So um, they are so awesome. Thank you so much to um, you teachers, the TVIs, um, teacher for the visual impaired uh, in our county. We thank you. We love you guys very much. And I know that you want David to succeed. And so um, we're going to work real hard. David's working real hard on his uh, GoFundMe campaign um, to uh, get his own Braille um, device so that he can be independent and um, and keep up with all of his uh, keep up with all of his classmates. So uh, thank you very much. Talk to you soon. Uh, let's. Uh, I'll turn the phone on. And uh, oh, I gotta turn. Alright, so there you see it. Control my phone with this. Page one and two, adjustable. Can you do that? I am. I'm doing it right now. What are you doing on your phone? Uh, just navigating my folders. So I could, I could go read a book. Can you go to YouTube? Yeah. Here's YouTube. Can you call up the Sex Blind Kids channel? Yep. subscribers 716 well, that's not enough <laughs> subscribe below <laughs> subscribe below yep all right that's cool yep all right now what you want to do call up an uber call up an uber with your with your brilliant just do a brilliant Back. see if you can open uber okay can you do that with um Doc. communication and social let's email. see i would have to figure out where it is i honestly don't use uber enough to Ah. I mean, normally I would do that on my phone. Phone directly, right? Well, I mean, I can. Oh, it's in, in my iCloud. I can't really like. Let's see if Lyft is anywhere. So normally, what I would do is just use for screen input and okay. go. Lyft. Oh. Oh, Lyft is probably in my iCloud too. I don't use it that often. Um. I don't know. What do I have? All my stuff is well here. Oh, everything's in iCloud. All right. What about Google? I can show you. Why don't you send me a text? Okay. What the brilliant? With brilliant, I do it on the uh, on the phone. Yeah. Okay. So first, I'm gonna open my messages. Oops. your message there message, and then I can say message, hello this, this is a text alpha test oops and I accidentally put it in another space so I'm going to delete send, it button. and then I can send hit message. send record audio button okay yep that's cool did you get it hello, yep you did yes you did okay cool and now I can do the same thing on browse screen input so if I switch my phone and then type in let me see your phone Oh. So explain what's on your on your phone right Okay, now. so basically there's a mode on my phone where it basically lets me type in Braille on my phone, right on the screen. Um, so basically, usually what I like to do is hold my phone like this, whereas okay. if you're using it regular, you hold it like this. Okay. If you're in so Braille. 
You know, you hold it like this. All right. Now let me. See. Okay. Now you're gonna do it. Yep. Okay. Uh, okay. Screen oh, you do that. Let me see oh. I don't know if it shows anything. It does. It shows one, two, three on uh -huh. the right, and four, five, six on the left. Oh, did I turn it the wrong way? Yeah, I did. Okay. And there, there you go. And then I can do this. Is a test. You know. Yep. Portrait test. And then I turn it back. Messaging apps visible. Send. Send. Send message. And there you go. Record audio. Okay. Cool. Yep. I should have said this is a test too, so that you would know. But oh well. This is a test too. Huh? All right. Now say goodbye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Can you uh, type in on the Braille Braille Brilliant on a text to me? Say please Message. subscribe. And send a text. Subscribe. Record audio. Button. Photos. Button. Uh, messaging apps. Visible. Button. Message. Photos. Button. Send. Button. Please. Send message. Record audio. Button. There you go. Please subscribe. All right. See you later. Bye bye. Bye bye.